Hello guys and welcome to a little playthrough today into Blue Valley. Just got a just released today on Christmas Eve. So let's go and have a little winter wonderland journey. Because it seems to be at least snowing here. Let's take a look. So anyway, this old folks, let me tell you, tape. One of those old ones from VHS one and then a label. I got curious and decided to watch it. Eh? Awkward silence. So anyway, you know what I'm like. I get obsessive with these things. I don't know why Matt is a stuck-up bitch. I don't know, but whatever. It can be ages to track down a VHS tape. It doesn't play properly. Hmm. Because can't be choosers, I guess. Those things are like a million years old. What was it up, anyway? Just a footage of a guy walking around in the middle of nowhere. His name apparently is Peter Abbots Abbotsfield. For some reason, the videotape has that information off on him. But anyway, I guess this is a ring style videotape and we're gonna all die as we watch it. So yeah, welcome to Into the Blue. As you can see, there's a lot of blue going up. Ooh, there's a guy over there watching us. Can we go towards that? Oh, that's not nice. That's not nice at all. Alright. So, this is of course a exploratory game and walking simulator. I think this is a proper word for that again. Ooh. At least we got some sort of narration. Oh dear. The video doesn't seem to be working well. Ooh. No, it seems to be a blue glow. Yeah, it's a blue glow. Yeah, he said it. He said that. He ends up collecting it. What if I just choose not to? Huh? Backtrack, so I'm just gonna go up, go back and pick it up anyway. I'm a boring person, but I. Uh -huh. There's stuff in the way. There we go. I suppose we have an axe now. And my axe! Oh dear. The video is getting all shaky and distorted. I must say, the music is beautiful. I love it. Very relaxing and... Oh, so bliss. This blueness and oh, the snow, the wind. Oh, I'd say this game should be played at some te therapy places or something. This is giving me already very chill vibes. Huh. A lovely Christmas gift. Well, okay, there's someone over there. I'm not sure. Read. The Woodman in. Coming for the Gales. Stay for the Gales! <laughs> Up ahead! Okay, well. Okay, so even that guy might be. Okay, he disappeared, but he still could be friendly. We've arrived to Blue Valley. Oh my god, this is pretty. Uh, okay. Yes, I'm after those glowing items. Oh, I can open door. Okay. Oh, the beautiful music ended, but uh, 
whatever. I guess it conti will continue when I get out back outside again. But it's a nice carpet you call there. And this shack is also quite nice. Everything is quite nice in the game. Seriously, the last three games I have played, there's been some sort of problem with stairs. There we go, I just sucked. Okay. Ooh, another note. Woe is me, woe is me, for life is to be lasting forever, gasping and never, joys of bling for butter and giving will never be had by us again. Unless you'll decide to abstain. That was a beautiful poem read by Stefura. Well, let's thank him for that. I have loved her for decades beyond me years. This gift, this fruit of time, I have lived through the laughter, the toil and tears, forever in my prime. To love more than others ever get to live. To spend it with friends who are blessed alike. I am chosen to be here with them and with her, for the morning, the noon and night. Huh, that was a nice thing. This writer has clear talent, indeed. I obtained... Well, I didn't even take a look what I, of what I obtained there. Okay, well, we found a glowing item again, so that's two out of eight. And let's just go outside. Beautiful music, beautiful music. No, we're not going to get to here because I have to open this door again. Well, for a nanosecond. We heard it for a nanosecond. That beautiful, beautiful sound. Uh, okay. I wonder if there's anything in here. Pots. And lots of blue gloom. Well, that's what the game is called. Into the blue glue. Alright. We have another letter. Daddy says they're coming for my bird door that the tree gave us to look after forever and ever. I'm a great hider, so they won't ever find it. Daddy will be so proud. Is it here? You suck, kid. Your daddy does not love you. <laughs> yeah, that was hidden pretty well. A dead bird? Well, don't say that. It's a bird toy. I think it's a toy bird, actually. Uh -huh. Well, fucking smart ass. Okay. Uh, can we go over here? We can. I thought that was just limited into a narrow path, but nope. Well, it is a narrow path, yes. We're going inside this solace and these mountains. So it is a kind of a narrow path of nature, but... And the town is probably the main focus of this. Hold on. There we go. Got inside. Uh. Oh. Isn't this nice? Sure, this is a ghost town. But it's... See, ghost people right over there. It's a ghost town. But it's so... Pretty. <sighs> okay, another house. Again, some bloom effects of blue. Blue is indigo. That's a citation from uh, the great Jesse Cox. The pain is unbearable. To spend this long in grief is unnatural. It never gets better. What I thought was transcending gift has become a twisted existence of longing for my dear sister. Uh, this could have been everything. Utopia. It means nothing without her. She was my blood, my born with them. Now she's gone, and he is leaving us. The threads of what should have been have descended into shattering chaos. My soul has been harped, and I cannot go on in this life. 
She made sense of all this. I'm throwing my lamp in the lake where no one can find it. Okay, so lamps probably have some significant significance. Ooh, is that her? Indeed. I wonder what the significance of lamps have. Oh yeah, that's just to read. And there's nothing else in this house. Okay, we move forward. The ghost people are still there. I guess they disappeared on a flash. But I decided to look the other way, unfortunately. Aww. First complaint of the game. The beautiful music cuts off every time you enter a building. And would I call this a game? Well, if we go by stand some standards, yeah, I guess this wouldn't be a game. But, but uh, more of an interactive story. But I still like it. So that's... no. Huh? Okay, so we found a little bug. We can't read this. Unfortunate. I'll post this video on the Steam forums and let the dev know. Okay, we move forward. I just want to check that we're going the right way. Uh, can't open those doors. Nothing really over there. Let's check the well. There might be something in the well. Well, no, it uh, the well just is there. Not really doing anything. So we had two paths. There was one path already leading up over there. And then we can go this way. Let's just, let's just go on the path. Forward towards whatever. Oh! That's a nice way to say that, oi dipshit, there's still something in the town. Well, I checked all the... well, let's go and take a look at the other side. Oh, there's more houses there, of course. Uh, I really want to know what's going on here, this is so interesting. At least here there seems to be story, unlike another game that was similar to this way back, the Aster. That didn't really have anything. Oh, there's three things to read. There we Access swords, horseshoes and more. Visit Anvil Specs with for all your smithing needs. Access guaranteed to bring the race down in one fell sloop or your money back. So was that one of them, and then... Um... Miller's Lake is treacherous this time of year! Please be vigilant! That's for the fans out there. With the annual festival tonight from today, Abbotsfield would like to remind everyone that tributes are to be placed no later than dusk. Your sacrifice at Lapis Arbus will not be forgotten. Okay, so there's cults. There's a cult. Fuck. Another note. Gone south to find better wood. Well, why would he need to tell any more than he has to about finding wood or getting wood? I prefer to find my wood downtown. And then he just left. How was he allowed to do that? We were always told we had to stay in Blue Valley, especially being one of the eight. One of the eight? <laughs> Casually looking through people's diaries and filming it. Welcome to the Woodman Inn, owned and operated by myself, Good Win Mead. With a variety of home cooked food prepared fresh by my wife Mabel. Enjoy your stay! Okay. 
Uh, can I use the ladder? I, well, there's a stair here, so why would I need to? Well, unless there's nothing over here. And this is the inn. A very small inn. I can use this at least. This is not an inn. This is a very tiny inn, if it is an inn. And that sound effect is a little deafening. No, 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 no. I don't want to go. I want to go down. Well, ladders are not my friend. There we go. Ah, got away. Well, nothing of particular interest in there. Although I want to see what this is. Is it a car? Oh, it's a car. So we got those. We are not in the 17th or 16th century. Oh, of course. It's in England. Everywhere's a pub. Oh, there's something to read over there. This! Now this is an N. Now this is an N. Indeed. I do wonder that myself, at least. Well, don't serve Harold until he's settled his bill. Refill the barrels, import preserves. Pick up signboard from Anvil. Tributes for festival. Alright. So there's the blue thing. Oh, oh, shield. A Viking shield. A warrior shield. And my axe. He said there was a blue in the goo here. The guy before I entered the building. But there is no blue. Unless I'm blind. Some coin. Haha. <laughs> I cannot loot the coin. Oh. Hello, good sir. How do you do? Uh, not really talkative, eh? Ah, downstairs. How did I miss this? Another thing to read. I need to stop her talking to him. They're planning something, I know it. If they lead together, I will find them and stop them by any means. Vow or no vow. Mm, people banging? Maybe. Ah, the Holy Grail! Was that number four? I think that was number four. It almost looked like the map of Azeroth. Almost, not quite. Alright. We got this blue thing from the pub. We can move forward.